Hello, welcome to my channel and for those few people that have been watching me in the past, welcome back. It's been a while. How are you? I hope you're doing well. So I had so many things going on like a few months ago. So for some that have been following my vlog, my other channel, I have I was building a house. I got busy when I was um, in the stage of finishing it and then moving in, we become busier settling in the new house now so and then i got tired already of making when you stop for a long time i feel like you don't want to go back making video again and i don't want to make video just for the sake of uploading one so i want to make a video when i feel like doing it and today is that day so i'm just here to declutter as you can see from the title i'm going to do a perfume declutter for the first time actually so this is not a huge one I'm just putting away some a few perfumes that i'm not really using and i don't think i'm going to use them but i'm not gonna throw them out i'm going to give them away because i do believe that no matter how bad you think that perfume is some people would love that would appreciate that because we have different types when it comes to perfume so without further ado first one is this one is not so long ago actually when i got this one this is for 711 um cologne perfume so i got this one blind by because it smells like i've heard it has a similar scent of tom ford's portofino which is yes it's correct and it has a lemon fresh scent which i like i do like the scent but not to the extent not what i expected i feel like it's too strong for me it would remind me of like a uh, wipes um kfc wipes sorts of sorts sorts yeah i find it too strong there is a scent there is something in here that it smells a bit like a cleaner i have nothing against a cleaner because i actually like the scent of my spray cleaner my cleaner at home it smells like such fresh lemon i like those types of scent but not just this one so i'm going to give this one away i know some people love this scent so i'll give that away whoever loved this one and then the other one is dimeter fresh brewed coffee i never use this one actually i only used this one the first time just to try it on after that mm. But it really smells like straight brewed coffee and i don't like it i like coffee scent but made me realize a straight coffee scent without anything mixed to it it doesn't smell good as a perfume so no not using that i'm gonna give that away and then next is the body shop british rose so this one i smell this one from someone i know and i really like it on her so i got this one myself too and I still like it whenever I smell this one, but not on me. Whenever I smell, I wear this one, I get tired of smelling it. I mean, I don't know how do you describe it, but I find it boring on me. Actually, the scent, I like how feminine it is, how soft it is. Just the type of scent that I like. But I don't know why that I just don't like the scent when I'm wearing it. But I'm sure a lot of people would like this one. This is actually a very pretty rose rosy scent not just for me and the next is another one from body shop this one is the japanese cherry blossom so this one i got it for the name it's japanese cherry blossom sounds nice and i could imagine the scent of a cherry blossom although i haven't seen it or smell it in person but i can imagine it from here it is fresh floral a little bit sweet just how you imagine the scent of cherry blossom but same as a british rose the moment i smell it i don't like it it just reminds me of those um um what do you call that um body spray from yeah bath and body works body spray victoria secret i feel like i've smelled this one uh, many times but i don't mind smelling a perfume many times because i do have a lot of perfumes that i love that are actually common and i've almost smelled them for almost any people but i still love them but this one i just don't like it it reminds me of like some kiddie splash cologne something like that but maybe some people would love this one as well i know because this is not a bad perfume i like the scent it's just not for me again so next is Ise Miyaki's EDT Ludice. So this perfume here, excuse me, so I haven't worn this one for a long time already. So I've only worn this several times. I've been trying this many times, but I don't like it. I've, there is a scent in here that 
is quite really strong i don't know maybe it's the cucumber there's a cucumber or melon scent or some white florals that i did not like and it's quite strong reminds me of a deodorant though it's very clean i find it clean floral scent but a little bit smells like alcohol or astringent um deodorant something like that but i find it fresh and it's good for um summer or tropical countries i think this one but i like the bottle though this is one of the reasons why i've been holding on this one for a long time because i like the bottle and i'm trying to like this one because this is quite one of the popular scent as well from isi miyake this is the original one but there's a lot of versions of this one i like the honey there's like a honey i have a sample of that i've reviewed that one before already version of this one which i like it better than this but i'm sure a lot of people would love this perfume as well so i'm gonna give this away so next is clinique happy heart this one very cute sleek simple girly bottle in here i like this one very slim this one i'm blind by all of these are blind by actually so this perfume i'm expecting of something else maybe quite soft floral feminine fresh scent but i find this one strong there is as a note in here that is quite overpowering i think it is i don't know i cannot remember what what's the notes of this one but there there is a little bit dissimilar with this one same vibe as this one the freshness of it maybe it's a floral or it's a cucumber or but they have that same astringent kind of scent Reminds me of those iskinol or like face astringent. Astringent or rubbing alcohol scent. Though it's very clean. Clean, refreshing, If you, especially if you are in a hot weather or tropical country. This one is a good um, refreshing scent. But I just find it strong and too synthetic for me. So next one is Dickie and Wise Be Delicious. Another cute bottle in here. Another reason why I'm holding on to this perfume because I like it. It's very cute. So this one is Be Delicious. So this one is an apple cucumber scent. I like the apple in here but not the cucumber. I just realized I don't like the cucumber scent in a perfume. They give me that strong alcohol synthetic scent. So this one is very fruity but not your girly sweet fruity scent. I find this one fresh, quite sporty kind of scent which I like though. So it's not the your usual sweet fruity scent but there is just again a note that i didn't like perhaps it's a cucumber again it's giving me that astringent alcohol too synthetic kind of scent so i don't like wearing this one too strong and overpowering for me so next this one is quite new in my collection as well and this one is ariana, ariana grande's rem or rem so this one i'm glad i only bought like the 30 mil i still have the holder of this one i don't know i can't oh, there there so here's the holder so i actually regret that i did not buy the cloud one because the cloud i smell it in the shop i really like it but i like blind buying so i bought the rem instead hoping that i would like it too but no i didn't like the it's very sweet hmm. nice but the moment i spray it on me i didn't like there is a lavender scent in here that i did not like so I like I'm getting that sweet like the meringue or icing hard icing scent but again the lavender in here I did not like it and also I'm waiting for the dry down I might like the dry down but still not so maybe it's not for me I have been trying wearing this one for a long time hoping it will grow on me but no but I know some more people like this one some they even like this better than clouds so I'm sure some people will be happy when I give them give that away next this is the last one and this is versace's bright crystal absolute so i'm giving this one away because i already have the original bright crystal and i find them a little bit similar there's only a slight difference on the two and i think i'm liking the original one better so i'm just giving this one away this one i find this sweet than uh, more fruity than floral the original one i find it more floral and this one is more fruity fruity and a little bit sour it's a bit of sourness in here i did a comparison on this and the original in my previous video but i like do like the original one so i'm going to keep it i'm gonna give this one away and that's it for now a very quick is it quick or long i find it quick declutter so that's for today's video and thank you for watching see you again next time hopefully soon not after two months so thanks for watching bye